In today's video, we're going to tell you how to see your frames per second in Fortnite for PC. Stay tuned. Welcome to Live Streaming Tech. And if you want to learn everything you need to know about live streaming, make sure you click that subscribe button and click that bell notification to on so you don't miss a single video. In today's video, we're going to cover how to turn on your frames per second for Fortnite, the PC uh, version. Now, this should work in other versions as well, but just to be on the safe side, we're doing this on the PC today. Well, the reason why we're shooting this video is we've had a couple questions. I guess people have seen other streamers do this when they're streaming Fortnite, they notice that they have their frames per second. The first question we need to answer is why do they do this? Well, as you know, people are super competitive when it comes to playing Fortnite online. So they want to be able to get that edge or not lose that edge. And for them to do so, they want to know how many frames per second they're getting. So that way, if they see any lag or any drop in it, they know to turn down the graphics or uh, play with their streaming settings. So that way they can have the most optimal frames per second when playing Fortnite. And it's very easy. So come on over and we'll show you how it's done. All you want to do is you want to come over here and you want to click that settings it's those three bars up in the upper right hand corner then we're going to go to exactly to settings now we're going to scroll down now we're, first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to turn that frame rate limit i'm going to put it in unlimited my brother has a decent pc he has the alienware or r7 and matter of fact the next video that you'll see on fortnite he's going to show you actually on different graphic settings what frames per second he can grab with the basic r7 setup so now we have it set to unlimited. Next thing we want to do is we want to click the show frames per second to on. That's right here. So it's going to be the second one up from the bottom. So now we have the frame rate limit to unlimited and we also have the show frames per second to on. Now here comes the issue. The issue is, is when you're capturing and you're streaming say Fortnite when you have the frame rate to unlimited, you're gonna see unlimited frame rates, but just keep in mind that whatever your OBS or XSplit or Streamlabs OBS or uh, Stream Elements OBS, whatever you're using is going to still cap out that frames per second. So that's something that you might wanna take into consideration when streaming Fortnite. But for argument's sake, we're gonna put it unlimited just to see what Dale can get in Fortnite with the frames per second turned on and to unlimited and by the way everything looks like it's set to epic so we're just going to leave that be we're going to hit apply hit it back now proof of concept we're going to go in and we're going to be able to see the frames per second now we're just going to jump into a solo match here real quick okay as you see we are now in the warm-up stages and with everything set on epic and he is pulling in about a 95 frames per second in the warm up area. You'll look at the frames per second is listed over on the upper right hand side, right next to the world map on Fortnite. So as you can see, the settings have took. And once again, just keep that in mind. I do have his frame rates per second set to unlimited. So if you say wanted just to be locked in at say 60 frames per second or 120, depending on what kind of graphics card you're using, um, you would have to go in and set that up as well. Okay, now we're gonna jump here real quick. We're gonna see what kind of frames we're gonna get. And here we go. Okay, so jumping out. We're, once again, he has the settings, the graphic settings, everything pretty much set on Epic. And he is pushing anywhere between 73 to 86, 47, 86 frames per second. And that is jumping down. So once again, as I parachute down slowly to my death, most likely, you guys see that there's proof of concept. All you have to do is go and hit those three bars in the upper right hand corner, go to settings, and it is the second button from the bottom and make sure you just turn that on that will show your frames per second and then up towards the top is where you can actually cap yourself out in frames per second or set it to unlimited hopefully you guys enjoyed that video but i know what you're going to enjoy you're going to enjoy this video right here where we talk about what servers and how to set up your servers on twitch till then see you around 